Mrs. Mkechi Ikwazu possesses a bachelor's degree in cooperatives and rural development, a master's degree in management, and a doctorate in management. She has worked as a teacher, an administrator, a banker, and as a registrar of cooperatives with Abia State Government. Fellow of the Institute of Management Consultant, member of the Academy of Management Nigeria, member of Chartered Institute of Bankers of Nigeria, and a certified management specialist of the London Graduate School. Mrs. Ipazo is a Paul Harris Fellow of the Rotary International. Her work in women's economic rights and empowerment earned her Vika Hope Foundation the United Nations ECOSOC Special Consultative Status. She is a recipient of the United Kingdom Government Award for making a difference in the fight against gender-based violence. She has received an award of distinguished excellence from Hajia Aisha Buhari, First Lady of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, and as most outstanding supporter for women by the African Regional Council for Women. Mrs. Ikpazo is a sports philanthropist and the major promoter of Nigeria Women Football Premier League club side, Abia Angels Football Club, sponsor of the Inkechi Ipazo Annual National Open Para Badminton Championships, sponsor of Abia Annual Interministerial Women Games, a matron of the Cycling Federation of Nigeria, matron of Para Badminton Association of Nigeria, and has been named Pillar of Sports in Abia State by the Sports Writers Association, SWAN. At the last count, Mrs. Ipazo has built 172 houses for indigent families, especially widows in Abia State. She has put a total of 600 people through a three-month skills development course and provided them with startup packs and startup capital. She set up clusters of traders in 13 rural communities, providing business growth funds, did direct cash injections into the businesses of hundreds of small-time rural-based women traders, and built market stalls so that the women traders can do business in comfort. Mrs. Ikpazo has done water projects in nine rural communities, constructed classroom blocks through Vikaho Foundation, donated classroom furniture to schools, and donated 328 wheelchairs and crutches to physically disabled persons, fitted 150 amputees with prosthesis. Mrs. Ikmazu's NGO, Vikaho Foundation, runs two sickle cell disease hospitals and three diagnostic centers in Abu State, where it offers subsidized treatment, management, counseling, and support for survivors of the disease, and has also facilitated the introduction of lessons on sickle cell disorder in all public schools, trained 2,000 teachers, and provided teaching aids, distributed drugs free of charge on a quarterly basis to sickle cell survivors, integrated free telehealth services for rural and hard-to-reach areas. As the wife of the governor, Mrs. Ikpazo is the prime mover of the Abu State Free School Meal Initiative, which she initiated in 2016, 11 months before the federal government homegrown school feeding program began. While the federal government national program covers only primary one to three, a coalition of partners under the initiative of Mrs. Nkechi Ikpazo fits primary four to six. Mrs. Ikpazo has been recorded in Nigeria history as the only first lady who has enjoyed the rarest privilege of being admitted to the floor of our legislative house to address a full plenary session of our state house of assembly, a privilege that is reserved for only presidents and governors. She has pushed for laws against discrimination, laws to protect disabled persons and children, laws to prohibit obnoxious widowhood practices and prohibit violence against persons, 
laws to improve health outcomes for Adians. Of the seven laws she has promoted, two have been passed and signed, with two more on their way to being passed. Her marriage to Governor Okezi Kwazo of Abia State is blessed with two boys and two girls. Ladies and gentlemen, we proudly present to you Mrs. Nkechi Ikwazo, Ph.D., wife of the governor of Abia State and recipient of the Sun Newspaper Most Supportive First Lady of the Year 2021. To God be the glory.